Mm, what's up guys? This is the Brave Woman and I am back to bring you to the next episode of My Empire Total War Let's Play as the United States of America. And in this episode, we are continuing to drive against the Austrians and we're going to capture a number of key cities. So we're going to attack the city of Prague and uh, we're going to occupy it afterwards to make sure that we have a solid front line against Prussia f later on. But let's not get ahead of ourselves, let's attack the city. So we have two supporting armies that we're almost certainly not going to use, so we are probably just going to keep driving them uh, into the Austrian territories and also start to position them tactically, ready for a future war against Prussia. I think, well, I wouldn't be surprised if the war with Russia is what kicks off the start of a, effectively, the last world war. I think, I think Prussia is allied with, Aust with Russia and the Ottomans. So, whoever declares on them first will likely lose the support of their allies in favour of the defender. But, that's just a guess. We'll have to wait and see. Okay. Don't want to attack through the town. Put my artillery out wide. How it's as open up. You know, actually I'll make this infantry plus both of my skirmishes will go wide. I might actually put a contingent of troops moving through the edge of the town just to screen my infantry force. With some heavy cavalry in support, keeping my other cavalry on the right flank, pushing forward more aggressively. And my rocket troop, fire whatever you desire. So, get my line to advance at speed. Because the enemy artillery is not. We can't just forget about it. So did you guys actually fire? No, you did not. Not much actually in. Well, Step will be in range, just not the artillery. Kimo Harris is firing round shot, just to try to get some shots off. Not actually in range of the enemy mortars though. How to find round shot is a terrible situation to be in. They are still good. We just need to be really aggressive with our right flank to push up and turn the Prussian, turn the Austrian flank. Rather. Not even a war with the Prussians yet. My howitzer is going to be. My um, rocket battery is keeping up a solid rhythm of fire. Okay, Thurheim Regiment, we start to drop against the Fusiliers. to advance up to this. Actually, you know, you can engage the um, Swiss Pikes as you like. Just out of range, really, of most of the useful units to do quick climb against. Swiss Pikemen being eviscerated by my volleys. I've lost 70 ish of their number. Some more. Okay, 
Okay, let's advance all my infantry up into the town. Radio guards, expat infantry. Run some of my cav- well, walk some of my cavalry around the left flank. Fly the line forward. If we can break that regiment, perfect. Regiment of horse, pursue that regiment of foot. Bayonet charge these mercenaries. Provincial cavalry reinforcement coming in. My QSI are going to eat them up. Losing lots of men quite fast. You men might fall back rapidly just, just to kill the mercenaries. Good old rocket artillery still doing good work. Bring out my cuirassier. My regiment of horse have probably got that, but I want to make sure. Start to redirect some of my artillery fire. Oh, it's a fire. Put the volleys in. Consent of Marine. Oh, the armed citizenry are broken. Problem is, you've let this uh, unit of Republican Guards kind of out on a limb now, especially because one of the units engaging them is Grenadier Guardsmen. The rocketry is continuing their bombardment of the enemy artillery positions. Advance forward. Okay, the enemy volley has killed their own men. Get these grenadiers around to try to support this combat, which is about to get Curacier of their own involved. to push some of my weaker units up to the front. So this unit of line infantry is being picked apart. Republican Guard versus Grenadiers. My... against Grenadier Guards. My Grenadiers should turn the tide. The enemy unit there is collapsed. Artillery, ceasefire, cuirassier, go attack the enemy positions on the hill. Get my infantry up. Push forward into the gap here. So the sick foot guards are going to come over the hill and hit the enemy here. Come on, heavy cavalry. Kill the provincials. Kill a handful more of them. Just turn around to try and fight us. Shattered. Perfect. Get up here. Perfect. I got to actually give my cavalry the orders to attack the enemy artillery positions. A couple are going to die running into stakes. Oh no! Bounced off of them. Quite nice.
the older Cuirassier units. I think this, yeah, this is their general unit. back. I did see the mine go off. Get my men into position. Rockets can't shoot. Howitzers are out of range. Biolock on citizenry. Excellent, the Grenadiers have broken. You've gone the completely wrong way. You may as well carry on. Who's that? Regiment of Militia. Maybe the enemy general is dead. Okay, enemy infantry withdraw. Cavalry come back. These are line infantry guards. These will not easily be turned away. Are you waiting for a pivot you a little bit? Make your arc fire point directly ahead of you. A lot of shells are gonna hit the um, a lot of bullets gonna hit this emplacement, but And my line infantry units to advance here. And my skirmishers to advance to about here. Just to keep the pressure on. And get my infantry into this gap. Fire will, you should be in there in range. Rockets away. Here they come, friendly fire. Cease fire. Seventy sixth are ready. First regiment of fusiliers. Oh yeah, there they go. A couple of units came back, but not enough to turn the tide. Prague is ours. Nice, nice, nice. If you definitely want to take Prague and Vienna. Those two will really break the back of the enemy. Excellent. How do you feel about us, Prague? You like us? Awesome, let's get repairing. Let's build the walls up. Get the army reinforced. You're waiting for this gun team to bolster your numbers. Sir. Jareth Colgrove, you're going to position ready to jump onto Breslau when the time comes. Okay, let's attack the Austrian capital. It's taken a long time to get here, but we grinded through their front line, and now they're really in trouble. Then once we take Warsaw, Austria's only got one territory left, so it's going to be a bit of a race to get towards that end to destroy the Austrians on the campaign map. Because towards the end, when you've got lots of armies, that's kind of what you end up doing. It's a lot easier just to be like right i'm going to defend all my cities you can't take any of them you can raid but you can't take any of them i'm just going to capture your cities one by one but at least in this case they have defenses they also have good artillery but it's not going to be enough for for it to matter to us 
War is nothing but a continuation of politics with the with the admixture or other means. Hey, I watched Crimson Tide the other day. I know that's a thing. But the real enemy is war itself, said Denzel Washington. Right. Oh, bugged heavy horse guard artillery. Perfect. Gonna have no idea what causes it to bug out like this, but I'll take it. I'll take it any day of the week. Heavy horse howitzer. So much artillery. This is the, a really good army to, to attack the city with. Okay, I need to form up exactly on this line. There we go. Oop, we got one. Cavalry just hunker down, let the artillery do its thing, and bugged general staff. <laughs> Blow away through. Their heavy horse guard artillery is firing, but I don't think it's. We're just in range of quick line, but not enough for it to be worthwhile. Especially with the command HQ in the way. Regulars are holding the lines. They've left some of their um, citizenry outside. Oh, I didn't even deploy this last unit of artillery. This is very much overkill. Artillery! Some guy just got smacked off the wall. Yeah, we are going to make one breach, then we're going to force it. Heavy horse howitzer. It will load faster than my howitzer, that's for darn sure. Unless they're reorienting. Garrison unit, you guys, you just keep doing what you're doing. This gun gun team at the back is going to attack the walls as well. Let's make that sweet, sweet breach. Ooh. Kill a bunch of civilians. Give me that breach. There we, here it comes. In my line, plus this bugged infantry. Well, not bugged infantry. The infantry I forgot about. You can advance. Artillery's going to engage this section of the wall. Use Elias. Bit of friendly fire there. Kill some of the few Elias on the wall. These are the ones that will do mega damage if they hit. They haven't yet. Citizen reunion got, got really badly beat up. Okay, so who have they got up here? Garrison line. Misfire. Okay, if they if this Howard's unit lands one on top of this. Wait a minute. To realize my regular howards unit is bugged as well. These 
poor devils trying to defend their city. One good hit in their dumb force. Let's. Oh, here it comes, hopefully. No. Oh. Bit of a misfire and landed short. Getting the fusiliers to start to waver. We're going to make this breach so that we can assault from two positions at once. And see what happens. They're defending this gate area, the gatehouse, quite strongly. More artillery shots. Is this unit actually firing? No, oh, but not necessarily at the target I wanted. No, they, no, they are. that chunk of men out and things will go really quite nicely. Let's engage a different line unit with my heavy horse guard power to unit. One percent almighty volley. Okay, let's take these three units and form offensive pocket these two units are going to push to try and assault that section of the wall these units are going to advance Try form a pocket while the skirmishers slowly sneak around. So we've got a unit up on the wall here, the Hala Regiment. I'd like to try and demolish this section, see how many of these units come down to defend it. Uh, if they're going to go all out to try and charge out, then we're going to quick climb the breach. Misfire, that would have been a great hit. Good hit. Oh, my artillery bombard the breach. Bombard this section. My howitzers can probably... Stand to engage the other fronts because this area is looking mighty weak. Yeah, they're panicking. So my gunners engage this section of this breach. Be able to hit that. Yeah, you can. You guys can re engage. Good hits. Okay, Grenadier Guards form up. These men back them up. Grenadier Guards are going to storm the breach. My infantry here are getting up here in numbers. Get in here. try get in. Bring up the cavalry. Should fire it well as off. Just 
just annihilating these units. We're keeping them pinned. Let's try and engage units on the wall. You men get in and start. Oh, they're, they're bayonet charging us, the garrison militia. Switched around shot, bombard the enemy infantry in the centre. They're already coming out to try and meet us. Let's commit these units into action now. Dragoons, get in here. General, get in here. There we go. Kill your way down these stairs. My well, light cavalry sharpshooters, I definitely want to get in here. Same with my heavy horse guard artillery. Horse guard artillery. My horse guard. Actually, they've committed their general. Oh, it's uh, ceasefire. Charge the center. Good, good, good. Uh, the enemy breach is completely empty. Oh, it's a uh, quick line, that regiment of militia. Kill the Light Dragoons. Quick, they've been quick blind, we can cease fire. Infantry storm in. I don't mind my heavy cavalry attacking the enemy infantry. We're absolutely going through these Austrians. Horse grenade guardsmen, charge that unit of militia. Maintaining their hold on the centre, but it's not going to help them. I think that's the crew. Yeah, these men hold the centre. Few men just pour through. Poor old skirmishes, they didn't really do anything. They can also come in here. Handful of militia left. Yep, here come the enemy reinforcements. Maybe it's me. One of you guys come over here and secure the gate. defending the fort broken the reinforcements have broken the artillery also ran away they left that gun S sir you left your gun behind well i suppose we'll have it okay capital of the puny austrians has fallen oops oops okay let's get out of the building Wait a minute, do you, do you have any movement points left? Sir. You do. Demand the surrender of Zagreb. They have no reinforcements. They should go. 
Excellent. Let's repair this, and then we have no money again. But we probably... Ooh. Bold move. Why immediately leave Lviv? Exempt them from tax. Next turn, I might... I, mean, I probably want to attack Warsaw now. Just to be sure. But next turn, I'm one turn away from their last territory. I think we've got to go for it. That would be quite a rapid collapse of enemy fighting strength. And then we effectively fortify our borders with Prussia and with Russia while we push up through the Middle East and declare war on Russia. I mean, things are different in, in, in um, Italy. Oh, good artillery position. Let's just all form up here. Form up our Grand Battery. Right, let's find the dastardly enemies. So these, two, these units are going to hold and see where the reinforcements come in from. Apart from that, the enemy is quite weak, so we're going to be attacking... Well, we're going to be attacking anyway. We're coming in directly behind their friends ahead of us. run forward at speed because the enemy artillery will have quick climb direct our artillery to engage other targets because we will soon be within glorious musket range we'll just thrash them with musketry they'll fall back we'll capture the center well within range good artillery hits from our own we're now just too close advance to point blank range Skirmishes and other elites. You can hold off here. Cavalry and loiter in the woods. They're actually a bit of a defilade. Ultimately, they're too far away for most of the game. You guys can push up too. Excellent. Oh no, they're about to retreat. Excellent. Take the position. The cavalry charge on the right. Switch to round shot. Engage the line tree. Provincial Cav, light skirmishers are going to really open you guys up. Push forward. Get the 62nd in, protect the armed citizenry alongside the cavalry. We now have position previously occupied by your former comrades march straight for their reinforcements don't give them time to form up in the way that they want Gut. The armed citizenry, oh, they're gone. Right. 
Regiment of horse. Push up on the left in case they've got any artillery. All my artillery. Limber up. So we're probably going to get to here and then hold while the artillery gets into position. Very tired, tired, tired. You may be tired, but I will bring you victory. As they reload. I know they're ready to go. to move up and split this horse heavy horse artillery off because they can actually run like the foot artillery that has to walk Swiss Jaeger, Hessian Jaeger, Swiss Line, Marines. Yes. You're brave now. Previously, courage has left you. It's with demolished. Building. Let's form a bit of a V shape here. Create a bit of a killing zone. Get all the armed citizenry, they've decided to come back. Goes at bar actually, just out of range. So push forward properly. Heavy horse artillery. But limbo. Too bad about this cart impeding our position. The withering fire of the light infantry. Excellent. Spread out, maximize firepower. You don't need to do anything else. Let's capture the town hall. Open for actually engage the Marines. They're the unit that actually doesn't want to rout. Regiment of Horse go after that unit of Hessian Jaeger. Cassier go after the Swiss Mountain Jaeger. Get in! You may have to open fire. Apologies, comrades. Oh good, they're not firing, they haven't got line of sight. Good. Excellent, these marines, the engineers. Push it up. Very unlimber. Try shatter them to make sure they don't come back. Okay, just taking the building. We're starting to get break down the windows. 
He stopped to pour fire into the 4th Regiment. This unit of militia. Okay, let's get... It's around this Swiss line with cavalry from all directions. Fusiliers get up to this road. You can occupy this last window. Shoot him. They're wavering. The Marines are about to open up a whole new front line. Or a new avenue of fire for them. Swiss line. I'm not long for this world. Not being mobbed by three units of cavalry from all directions. Withdraw. Excellent. Warsaw's taken. We haven't got the money to get it up into shape right now. Okay, I might use you just to go knock out that force garrisoning the HQ. The garrison the university, just so I can knock it down. Because that will really, although it doesn't really matter. Uh, exempt them from tax for now. Just because we have no money. Then next turn, you're in a position to smash through these units and attack Klausenberg. And then that will remove every Austrian unit from the field. Very enticing. So over in India, pretty sure. Every, we've done everything we need to do. Everything else is very much is very much in, in uh, process. Graz. Knock down Graz. Krakow's being knocked down. Cool. Let's hit end turn. Got the juggernaut of the US armed forces is just pushing up to that Indian frontier. I imagine once we take out the last of the Maratha forces, we will probably have a war triggered against us by the uh, Russians. You can run around, raid to your heart's content. <laughs> All of their gentlemen are desperately falling back. Uh, you know what? You do you. I forgot that, that fragment of an army might have gone and whoo, they could have taken our territory. That would have sucked. Okay. War with Poland is coming. With with Prussia is coming. I need to knock out the the um, Spanish as well. But I need to see what their alliances look like. Or at the very least, I need to have an army ready to lunge for Madrid. At any time. You're, ooh, you're actually pushing up. See, this is why I want crossings. I want my crossings covered. It made things so much tidier. The Ottomans sense that trouble is on the horizon. And it's going to come at them from every direction. We've now got a border in the Balkans. I think in Europe, what it's going to really come down to, can I just hold off the Ottomans, the Prussians and the Russians all at the same time while my forces in India blitz through the Middle East and up into Russian, the Russian interior, really? I think that's what it's going to come down to. Yeah, Klausenberg is ripe for the taking. Ottomans. Yeah, the Ottomans are doing classic Ottoman things. Very much par for the course. Okay, Italian states have gone over quite quick. The Russians are another one that make things last, but 
Lots of their armies are depleted, so I have to wonder, are they bankrupt? Hmm, are they bankrupt indeed? We do need to go and um, capture the Italian peninsula still. Enemy raid. You know what, Poland? Raid as much as you like, because... Oh no, we're not actually... Can't do it in one turn, because they've got not got the... They haven't got the chops. Rats, I thought that would be this turn. Either way. Right, raid in the forest. That's kind of a problem now. But I imagine they're probably not strong enough to attack even a weak garrison. Fleet arrives. Emmett Gascoigne. So you're here. You're going to eventually replace this fleet once the trade ships arrive. And you are going to deploy your army. Ready to attack Spain. You men are going to wait right here. Then when the time comes, you're going to make a dash for Madrid. Okay, upgrades. Eugene. Okay, right. You upgrade your weaver's cottage, upgrade your roads. Savoy. Becoming, it's becoming a more and more Catholic. Oh no, sorry, they wouldn't have been... Milan still has to be taken. Let's just deal with that now, because there's nothing there. Get rid of the government buildings. We don't really need it. You guys are replenishing well enough. Okay. Bavaria, get a College of Divinity. Katak gets one as well, plus... Yeah, better roads. Medeberg, Heidelberg, Nagpur. You can probably leave now. You're ahead of ourselves. Okay, so you get better roads. Marlon Rose. Yep, yeah, they can handle it. Push up this way. Okay, we're not going to wait for... So one thing I do need to do is quickly hop over to Warsaw. Prepare everything. The army's replenishing. You're exempt from tax. They shouldn't. Um, they shouldn't rebel. So I'm going to fall back to the bridge in case anybody fancies giving me an easy battle. Ronald Babington is. Okay, your, your army's reinforcing. Let's build a church school. Rebuild the port. Okay, let's upgrade the trade port. Don't necessarily worry about the military port. Works on strike in Poland. Yes, they are. Works on strike in Austria. No, they are not. Works on strike in Galicia. No, they are not. I'll up okay, I'll, re I'll, upgrade I'll re repair the lumber mill and I'll upgrade the farm. See if I can lure them away from Lviv because we are so close. But in India, where we want to focus our effort. You're getting your guns. You got orders to push. You got orders to push. Great. Yes. You just. Crush them. Proud and victorious. Just a fragment Make of an army, ready. anyway. March. Immediately. Push forward. You can take the long way round, just in case. March. You can take this way around. Sir. Your orders. 
Okay, good, good, good. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. At the ready. No more Marathas are coming through this crossing. That's for darn sure. You guys are here, but we can probably... Hmm, can't quite deal with you yet. Can you leave Kashmir? Not yet. Our Gurkha recruitment has begun. Sir, your orders immediately. Make ready. Any further orders? Two units of Marines. Let's get rid of one line infantry Forward. unit to make room for a Gurkha Forward. unit. March. Prevents us from being able to attack these units, but yes, sir. part of me doesn't mind because this army can make a shot straight for Kabul. Oh no, there's troops in the way. Too bad. Uh, yeah, let's go for Kibble. We're very close to the end of the episode, but I think that will be a a good thing to do. Take take this territory. Then we're very close to the Marathas and the Austrians just not being an enemy anymore. And then it will be focusing on new enemies for the rest of the campaign, which is rapidly appre approaching its uh, end. Well, end. Still got a few episodes to go. Um, but you know, we're making a lot of good progress. Keep an eye on the rain. But these are eastern, eastern fortifications fall really quite quickly. Hey, okay. whoops, that's caps lock, not shift. Cavalry. Yes, they've got reinforcements, but we don't really care. Quick line, the center, because look at it. going to come out and attack us. Looks like they are. You better carry on firing. So they do have a mortar unit, but it is quite vulnerable. However, it looks like they may attempting to sally. So this is some kind of trick. It's a very good trick. Wait until my wait until my howitzers find out about this. Because they're aiming here. Come on you man. Fire, I don't mind if I get some friendly fire. We thought we need to keep aiming for the breach. Bit of friendly fire. We need to keep aiming to create a breach, that is. There we go. One right through the door. And suddenly, oh my god! <laughs> we, we don't want to be here for this. Broken, shattered, shattered, broken. You, you, you sure you want to be here, Islamic Swordsman? Are you sure? Okay. One of their mortar units is actually advancing towards us. Okay. Come on, you man. They've knocked down two of our gun teams. You will, should get back into the saddle. Let's get my general back here. Engage the wall. The, your, your... Shoot it. What I want you to shoot at. Good hits. 
Oh no, they're still not. Not shooting at what I want them to shoot at. My artillery is useless and bugged. Is it the target you don't like? If I just give you that section of, of this section of wall. Weird, really weird. Yeah, this is not the normal um, behaviours that Empire used to have. This is something that's happened years after the game's come out. Artillery acting weird like this. That's not a thing that used to happen. At least not for me. Let's limber the guns up and then unlimber them again. all the risk that happens with that. One gun. Additional firing. God alive. I'm so lucky that I'm so lucky my howitzers are still doing stuff. Problem is their guns are still firing, so we need to make their breach quickly, because if they get some lucky hits on our howitzers, we're a little bit screwed. Shot hit here, bounced off, fell now and landed on top of the armed populace. Good old howitzers. Howitzers don't let me down, and like foot artillery. only so long I'm willing to screw around with these guys and try and make them actually do what I want them to do. Because they, they never like orders being given to them during when time's been um, compressed. They never like that. They always hated that, for sure. Okay, advance. We have our breach, which we can attack if we want. Try get these guns to attack over here. Let's see if that works. They're all still focusing in the centre, so some quick line round should do some really good damage. You fired. You didn't fire at the targets. I wanted you to fire it. Some of the targets are in range. I don't like the stuttering. I don't like the stuttering that's happening. That's concerning. I'm not quite sure what's causing that. Probably the, the ghost mortars that are just rolling forward. One of you needs to attack that Bajir infantry unit, the other the knockout units in the centre. Typically, round shot would do a great would do great against these guys. Just knock this entire corner down, problem solved. You are reloading. Bajir infantry, I think I might be able to overwhelm them. Killed the enemy general, great. I'm 
Ghost Mortar carries on. Okay. Get all my cavalry over here. step it's kind of why we've got so many <laughs> so now that suddenly exploded Okay, they do. Okay, they do have a way to get up. Cool. That, that's definitely not spider support. Spider support. What are these guys doing? You wait till I get down here. Oh yeah, the whirling dervishes. They've got in on the flank. I guess my sepoy troops, they might do okay. This Bajir infantry, though, they're starting to get outnumbered. New men start scaling the walls as well. Too bad they're all clustering up one through one set of ladders at once. Okay, you come over here and give them a hand. You guys were going to originally. Well, you still might be able to eat. Well, to be honest, the gate is open because they got sky stuck in it, so... You guys can run through this gate to get in. They're losing steadily to my sepoys. My Indian mercenaries are now coming in, though. not attack the center. So all of my cavalry is about to stream in here. It's just a round shot attack. Anything else? Still down as winning. No, nope. you guys have decided you are right. Good. This battle is really bugged. Okay, you men have to push in. Grassier, go for the camel gunners. Colonial Light Infantry, just go for the enemy around us. Colonial Light Cavalry's attacking out. They've closed the gate. Now it's time for the anybody, anywhere, free for all. Mercenaries going in. Brother against brother. Bajir infantry is surrounded. 
light infantry are attacking us on the wall, which is a problem. Yes, an infantry unit here can make it around the flank. These sepoy units wavering. Understandably, they are significantly low. Okay, these men get into the center. Hold it. These men are going to get into the centre, form square, so the colour party's in the centre of the city, holding it for the glory of the American Empire. Soon they should probably crumble under the pressure. Let's make sure the artillery ceases fire. There we go. So it's all up to this unit on the wall. Nope, they broke as well. And they're going to use our grappling hooks to escape from. Intense. This unit on the wall is still around, but nope, they've broken too. Awesome. This was a real... So the occasional like stutter was really concerning. I did not want to go too crazy in case the um, the game crashed, especially because I've just finished an episode. That would suck. The ball is ours, and understandably they hate us. Now the university will help. It won't get rid of the camera for a form, it will get a long way. Oh! The Marathas are gone! The Baluk rebels have taken their place. Okay, let's get some of our units new orders. Advance up to... I mean, you're still going to attack the city. Put a lot of these armies push to the border. Push the border, ready for the inevitable dust-up. I didn't think that was going to happen. That was awesome. Okay, let's keep get you out of Punjab, get you guys back inside. Just because we want to get these territories under our control. Let's get better roads in Kabul. Upgrade the cotton plantations. Everybody else has move orders already. Well, I may as well give you move orders to just run all the way up to the border. You should be deeply concerned, um, Russia, because we're on our way. Can't repair the global trading company. Can't do anything else. Um, Looks like I'm, I'm going to hit end turn, because right now there's not really a huge amount to do. Because next turn, if we can knock out Austria, that'd be huge. But thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.